is the big bad boy. He's telling me, get off of my island. Oh, man. Better be quiet. Don't worry, bro. I'm not touching your salmon and I'm not shooting shotgun shells today. Oh my God, you're huge. I'm about to get out of here. Best damn way to get around in this country. Bicycles. Heron. There he is. He says, forget about all this warfare. I want peace. I'm going back to California, love. They don't call it U.S. Army Corps for nothing. These, some, these ain't no Marines. These is Army boys. What's, a, what, what's an Army boy know about? Know about a Marine. Marine sea creature like that. Look at him. Animal the size of a Mark IV Jetta in this river right now. Outside the Bonneville. That bird could get crunched up by a sea lion. California sea lion. They're sitting right there at that fish ladder. Had one just about a dozen meters from me. Seagulls? No. That's a hawk. Sounds like a seagull. No seagulls? Wouldn't be surprised if seagulls followed the sea lions over here. Bonneville Dam, uh, probably a hundred miles from the, the ocean. A long ways from California. Though, a lot of the electricity, I don't know about this dam, but most the electricity we get at our dams, hashtag uh, take out Savage Rapids Dam, gets sent right to California. There's a straight line from the Dalles Dam right to California where they uh, buy most of our electricity from us. And what do we get in return? Californians. They come and breed here right in these waters. Sea lions, though. Yeah. This is how you walk on rocks. You find a broken fishing pole to maintain your balance so they don't fall in, become a snack, or become electricity. Come down to the historic town of flooded Bonneville, Washington, where the, uh, the menu's great. Our restaurants are top notch. We have right here, we call it the Fish Ladder. It's a five-star restaurant getting multiple four-star reviews from the average sea lion and uh, multiple three-star reviews from below average sea lions who, you know, they wish it smelled fishier. It's a beautiful day to be behind a dam 20 feet under what looks like a watermark for some part of the year. Lots of moss at that watermark, um, which my daughter thinks my beard is made of moss. She asked me yesterday, are you getting your moss off while well, I was shaving? Occasionally I'm hearing shotguns, uh, mostly these little rounds that detonate in the water to there was one, sounds like it. Um, there's government workers over here who sometimes shoot into the water and uh, to scare off the sea lions. What are the repercussions of scaring off a sea lion? Well, they probably get mild ear damage or at least um, bad headaches. Um, depending how explosive the round is, and that's obviously in the water where this stuff hurts um, more to your your ears. It, uh, it could really hurt sea lions. Not as much pain inflicted on them as they're inflicting on the salmon, however. So, who's the real bad guy, I guess? A uh, hawk just dove right into the water. Good job, little hockey puck. Little hockey puck. Or are you a bald eagle? Oh, um, my eyes, my corneas. My corneas just aren't what they used to be. That's a, that's a, just a really mean pigeon. I want to get a good shot of these sea lions, but they uh, seem to be over at that other fish ladder today. It's 
on the other side seen a few heads bobbing bobbing their head to the beat of what it sounds like when you're out there just eating as much fish as you can uh you know hanging out with your girlfriend and showing her you know this old town of bonneville's got got great eats i mean good thing for us it's flooded um because i don't do too well at a real restaurant oh saw one bob his head way out there this is 4k video so possibly if you zoom in you're gonna see the goods those little pumpkin heads are way over there it's one of the best places out there you could lose a set of airpods you could lose a set of airpod pros here too the might get eaten by birds they're right above me now and i'm pretending i'm out here fishing for lampreys total pretend these little fishies in down here though yum if you're a little crab you want to eat a dead one come down here instant gratification let's go get those sea lions i'm just gonna say hi oh gonna eat that bird don't know if that happens very often but maybe one out of every ten thousand bird Look at that thing. That thing would be nice to eat. A little cormorant. Come on, sea lion. Don't do it today. Stick to fish. This is the big bad boy. He's telling me get off of my island. Oh, man. Better be quiet. Don't worry, bro. I'm not touching your salmon and I'm not shooting shotgun shells today. Oh my God, you're huge. I'm about to get out of here. Cause this guy. I'm doing man please don't eat anybody today gosh you're huge he's mad a couple fishermen said this is a total brawl right here oh my gosh his head his head's easily the size of a watermelon don't worry bro I'm just getting this clam oh now he's coming right in he is straight up intelligent and telling this young kid right here to stay back from his salmon. No, he ain't doing that. He's just, he's coming this way. He's just getting um, familiar with their technique and when they're gonna cast and he's gonna catch that food, but. Oh. Otter prints, right by where that kid was standing fishing. If it was gonna attack him, I mean, at least I would've had it on video. I don't know, he doesn't look like the biggest one, but it's pretty big. Woo! Uh, walking up to the US Army of Corps Engineers visitation center for fish ladder viewing half mast flags presumably for uh, supreme court justice passing away that's what i think um, shots were just fired at some sea lions two of the Rounds that go off underwater and don't sound very loud. And then one really loud one, which may have just not made it to the water. Wow, it's orange in here. Oh, that's why. This whole room is shaking like thunder. Oh my gosh, those are the turbines for the dam. And they're classically orange. Like a uh, Coast Guard kind of orange. And now oh, I have this nice carpet in here too. Village of Chinook people who may have lived around here. Um, well, archaeologists working hard before they flood this area. But what are they going to find? Chinook Indian uh, burial sites other artifacts of their village. 
made it look like this. Did they have horses? Well, not forever. They may have got some. Did they have banked babies? That's for sure. Did they hang their salmon up like that? Most likely. Did they have that kind of dog? Some kind of collie looking thing or maybe a sick small horse? That's a guarantee. As loud as this dam is, their air conditioning system is louder. Kaplan. Best turbines this side of Kentucky. Damn. Best damn way to get around in this country? Bicycles. And the best way to cool off after biking around generator sites all day? Ping pong and some brews with the bros. Been up here alone for about half an hour because nobody gives a damn. Visitation. Man, I wish I lived here. I wish this is where I showered every day. I'd love to come here and take a bath every once in a while. I'd eat my cereal right here every morning and read a newspaper. Oh, there he is. <laughs> come on, Fiji. Eat one of those spiders. especially uh, totally some broken eardrums in those sea lions unless their eardrums are so strong that they put up with it because the freaking food here is so good it's worth a little bit of pain oh jeez heron Forget about all this warfare. I want peace. I'm going back to California, love. They don't call it U.S. Army Corps for nothing. These, some, these ain't no Marines. These is Army boys. What's, a, what, what's an Army boy know about? Know about a Marine? sea creature like that. Look at him. And these guys will be around. Ooh, he's firing at me now. Okay. That was close. Mysterious dude in white jogging with a shotgun. Firing from the hip. And chasing those sea lions out of dodge. Sea lions. Guess you're not welcome here. I hope you got a couple good snacks. <laughs>